and we're seeing ya. Terry back at you with another video. A while back we did a hair tutorial for a multi-layers braid, link in the description if you have not seen that. But anyway, for today's video we are doing the multi-layer braid again with a second version. So the first thing you want to do is brush out your doll's hair, remove any knots, any tangles, and then separate out a small piece of hair. Roughly this size should be good. And then you're going to break that smaller piece into three pieces and make a braid. Once you've reached the end of the hair, grab an elastic and put it in. Hopefully you have elastics that are smaller than me. This is my smallest. Grab a second small piece of hair, as equal as you can to the first piece, and again, we're going to braid. braiding hair trunks that size until you have braided the entire head of hair and your number of small braids should be a number divisible by three. smaller braids done. Going back to what I said about multiples of three, we have made nine different braids and ironically mine have perfectly matched out to be three pink, three green, three purple, which is going to be really helpful for our next step, which is to take the smaller braids and make three bigger braids. So I'm going to start over here with the pink braids and all you want to do is use each braid as its own strand to make a new braid. So now you want to place in your elastic. This is where it helps if yours are thinner than mine, but I don't have anything smaller, so I just have to go with it. There we go. Do the same and braid what in my case are the green elastic braids. do the third and final medium braid, in my case the purple elastics. Here's what it looks like when you have turned your nine braids into three braids. So if the elastics are a little messy, it'll all be cleaned up by the final step. Now, for the final step of the braid, you are just going to take your three braids and make one big braid out of them. It's 
it's quite, it, might, it might be hard to do with all the elastics, but try your best. And then add your final elastic. This one needs to be a nice big one, like a scrunchie or something, and try to hide the small ones. Or you can just take the small ones out if you'd rather. This is what your multi braid should look like when it's done. I didn't take out all the elastics, as you can tell there are still three of them wrapped on the bottom, but I did take out most of them. A more close up view of the layered braid. That wraps up this multi layer braid version 2 tutorial. If you liked it, please drop one down below. Subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any future content. Check out all of our social media accounts in the description below. And lastly, please head to our website. There are cute outfits to purchase, including we now sell pets, and there are also fun stories to read. See you on the next one.